family. family. It's your girl, Queen. It's your boy, Clarence. And we are back with, with another, another for your, your mother. mother. Yo mother. Not your my mother. mother. Yo mother. Honestly. Yo mama. We had some moms come up to us for like the meet and greets. And they say they love it. Yeah, so it is free. A lot of people do love that. Yeah. A lot of people come to They love the fact that we say for your mother. Yeah. See, I'm glad. You thought it was, you, you might have thought nah, it was corny. I, yeah, but you, that's all you. I'm saying. Please. Today's topic is about relationships more so our relationship our relationship and and maybe it would help you yeah maybe in it your would. relationship yeah so i'm not like no expert on relationships Me neither. but from experience i think from i think we learn ex like from our past experiences and like this ex this experience with us we kind of like learned some stuff oh yeah learned a lot um and so the title is do we argue and i know that might sound like a stupid question but y'all might look at us and be like oh my god they're so perfect perfect and things like that but i don't think any relationship is like perfect and will ever be but you can have two imperfect people perfect for each other mm -hmm. But no relationship is perfect. Or a relationship could be perfect for you. You know what I mean? Like, it, like we're not perfect, but I feel like, I feel like you're perfect for me though. Like the type of person I am, and then like vice versa. Yeah. I feel like you need a person like me. I do. Yeah, like I it's feel like, like you're perfect for me too. Yeah, I do. No, honestly. We make each other, but nah. I'm honestly, I've thought, of, I've thought. Of we do it. have like I'm honestly. I'm so like I'm so serious. Like, I'm so serious and, like, not, like, and so closed in. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't really let people close to me or in to my circle or where, what we do. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's all her. Yeah. That's, that's what she's good but at. But, like. You know what I mean? She likes, she's very friendly. Yeah. Very, like, colorful. And she just wants everybody to be happy. And you really want to make everybody happy and please everybody. And he kind of just don't give a f about. I'm a little more people. blunt, yeah. yeah. When, like, and when it comes to like people, man. pleasing people and making people happy, he more think, you know. But we balance each other. It's a out. balance, though. Yeah, it's a balance. Some like if he if I feel like he wrong about something, uh, I I will tell you. And on, he tells me if he feel like I'm wrong, it never get like it's arguing like he's moving. Is is arguing like what we would call it, or do we call it? I don't think we argue. Like that's one thing. Um, I don't think we've argued before. I don't think it's if, cause any, arguing anything, is like going back and forth. Yeah, like I don't like we don't we don't do that. We'll but we but we do have disagreements. You know what I mean? That is important. My fault. It's important uh, to have like good communication, especially when you have a disagreement. You know what I mean? Yeah. Hey, me, uh, right. No, me, you go ahead. Me and him was raised differently. Yeah, very. Like, like, we was raised, like... I noticed, like, in the beginning, I thought that we were kind of, like... Similar. Similar. Very, very similar. But as as things went by, I see that we not so similar in some areas. Like, we, was, we wasn't raised the same way. And so that could be, like... That could be like a little, I don't know, tough. A little tough sometimes, but because now we live with each other. Yeah. Now we're, now we're like having. Yeah. Like, so now I mean? so we, you gotta take, like I. Everything, like all the principles and morals that I've learned, I'm trying to now instill in my household. But then she has different, like you know what I mean. So it has to be like a compromise. A compromise or a middle. Yeah, a middle. So I think that's the hardest part is bringing your beliefs and my beliefs together to teach this one. Mm -hmm. And then not only that, but just for me, having just a sep uh, another child that's not by you, I don't want Renzo and CJ to, if they're going to be in the same household, I don't want them to be raised differently. Different or have different principles. So I also them. have to, like, if whatever we teach him is like, I want to make sure CJ or Renzo don't ever feel like they re being raised different if mm -hmm. they brothers. Like I feel like if you raised under one roof, you should be raised mm -hmm. the same. No, but you know, I give you, I give you advice. On yeah, CJ he give me advice too. on CJ, but it, it don't be I mean? bad because it's like 
I gotta, I have to love CJ. It's like, that's my son's older brother. He's gonna adore CJ. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? I know CJ's gonna adore him. So it's like, and I know my son is gonna follow CJ. Like, yeah, because that's his big brother. Yeah, like that's his big brother. So you know what I'm saying? So I need, so I would, I'm, I would love to help you with, like, you know what I mean? Like yeah. not help you, because I know like his father's still in his life, but still like help you. So it's like, it's gonna be so easy for Rendell. I tend to spoil like, CJ a lot, so, but honestly. But as she should though, like all moms should, like that is a mom's job. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. You got what I'm saying? But it's like, <clears throat> when when I was a little kid, I was spoiled too, but it's like my mom had a sense of discipline in her, where it's like, yeah. don't play with me. But like, see, the all, thing all, is, like all I ha all my mom had to do was look at me and I would, with me, you know it's different, saying? CJ. But nah. see, the thing is, your mom had to be your mom and your dad at a point. Yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. exactly. I never had to do that. I, all, I always was... Because he has his dad. Yeah, I always yeah. only, you know, it's supposed to be mom. But bottom line, what, what I'm saying is, like, we were raised differently. So we have to come together and compromise. So some of the stuff that we was raised on or some of our different beliefs sometimes make us have disagreements. Mm -hmm. Does it make us not talk? It make I mean, us we've not never talk? went a day. We never no. If we if we we might be quiet towards each other like for a little bit like because I don't I don't believe in like constantly nagging someone um, because then that's how they get tired of you. Like you're supposed to give someone a space if you know you know they just not really feeling it and then go talk to them. And I think another thing is that we're always around people. Like, we're never by ourselves. We always have security guards. We have tour managers. We have a manager. We have, like, I just, we're never alone. So it's like, and I'm never going to, like, I never want to, like, mistreat her. Like, or, like, even argue in front of people. Like, nah. I mean, I'm, like, I'm real, like, tedious on, like. Nobody should know that we Exactly. Into it. Like, you know what I'm saying? No one, like, the only way, reason why y'all should know is that, like this right here. If we, like, tell you guys, or, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, I'm not going to go on Twitter and tweet something. So, like, even yeah, if you see a tweet that might be, like, oh, no, no they're arguing, it's not. Because yeah. if we are, I won't tweet. Like, I won't tweet about it. You know what I mean? So, it's just. I won't either. Like, yeah, we're not gonna, like, we're not And I'm not gonna it. drop hints that like, we're going through something so that, so, if I seem a little sad, people are like, are you and Claire good? Da -da -da. No, yeah. Like, y'all are never honestly, you know, don't, don't assume that mm -hmm. it's like me and And we're gonna, we always figure it out. We like, figure it quick out. quick too, like, I'm, and, and that's why I say, like, this is, it's so refreshing because, like, not to, like, bring up the past, but, like, in my past relationship, you know what I'm saying? It was more like arguing, like going back and forth. And like, but I don't like to argue. And like just little petty, about petty things though, like about things that you don't even look at. Like, you know what I mean? Like my phone or <laughs> tweets or like who's that girl you're speaking to like at the, at the end of the show. Like, you know what I mean? But you know, like... I know I'm closed in it, but I'm friendly too at the same time. It's like weird. It's weird. You know what I'm saying? You're friendly, but you're not too friendly. Yeah, like I'm not going to go out. Like I'll meet a person and talk to them. Like, you know what I mean? And like see what their business is like. What my I'll tell them, give them my story. But I'm not going to invite them to my house the next day. Yeah. That's more what Queen would do. Like meet someone and invite her. Claire, for I wouldn't do that. No, you would do that. No, would lear that. no learning from you over time. Yeah, I, know, I wouldn't I, do when that. When I first met you. You would have probably, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm really nice, You would meet so, somebody and, like, she's her best friend the next day. Okay, not to my house. Maybe out to dinner. Yeah, like, but she's, like, now she's your friend. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. off of one day. Like, I can't well, do that. Well, my friend from the meet and greet. Yeah, like, <laughs> I can't I can't do that, you know what I mean? But that's, just, honestly, that's her innocence, though. And, I, I honestly, that's one of the things I love about her. Honestly, I don't really get too mad at I don't. I don't feel some kind of way when he got girls at his meet and greets and, like, girls... Saying stuff to him because honestly, like I knew what I was getting myself into before I got into this relationship. I knew that on his Instagram, he had mad girls under there calling him daddy, hard eyes, all that. Like I knew what I was getting myself into. So do I expect that to stop when he get with me? No, because I feel like these females probably don't feel like they owe loyalty to me. 
And what is that really doing to me just because they comment something or DM him? Mm. It's really up to him, like, what he going to do. Like, mm. I can't get mad at the girls. I feel like right now, like, I think, like, it, our trust hasn't really been, like, hindered. And then, like, nah. You know what I mean? So she trusts me, and I trust her. You're confident, too, in what you do. Like, I'm confident enough to know, like, like, even if you like her and, like, want it, like, I'm confident enough that, like, you can't do what I do. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, even if you decide... I feel the same way, truthfully. Yeah, I like, even if you decide to do something, then that's on you. And you're going to have to live with that. But, like, losing me is a loss. Like, you know what I mean? I feel, and I feel and like, losing you is a loss. Yeah, and I feel like you the same and way. And I you feel have like losing same. me is a loss, too. Like, we both feel the same way. I Truthfully, I, like, to be honest with myself, I know, I feel like I'm a pretty girl. I know there are, like, bad girls out there probably try to holler at you. But at the end of the day, I still do feel like nobody is like me. You want to try with the food real quick? That's a well, little weird. It said 315. Sorry, guys. I don't think somebody will give you the same feeling. Oh, it's still. Yeah, that's yeah. really view order details. Yeah, sorry. This is our first time ordering from, from Grubhub. Grubhub. And it's like. Oh, it's on the way. So. Okay. All right. So they'll probably call. Yeah. You put. You had to put your number in? Yeah, I did. All right, but. So come on. What you were saying? I was saying that, yeah, like. You know the girl like you. You beautiful. Huh? huh? What'd you say? I said there was no other girl like you. I just don't. I just don't think that. Like even if, cause honestly, I'm, I'm not. The, you now. Well, I'm just picking. Okay. You want to trip it? I'm even more. I was just trying to clean it out. Okay. Well, yeah. What was I saying? Claire, you keep throwing me off. Sorry. Go ahead. I just feel like there are other good girls out there. I'm not the only good girl, but we are rare. I think it is rare to yeah, find a good, someone. A, a good girl is rare nowadays. I feel like it, it's rare to find somebody like me. And again, we're not saying that like we're perfect. Do you get what I'm saying? But I think what we what we're saying is what we bring to the table outweighs probably the bad that may come with us. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it's like with me, like like right for instance, I want to tell you a story. When me and Queen. And Patty was there too. And uh, when me and Queen was moving in, we had ordered furniture and like these, um, we had ordered furniture. We was waiting for furniture all day. You know what I mean? So you had took CJ downstairs to the pool. Oh yeah. And y'all was chilling. You know what I'm saying? You had your swimsuit on. You was looking like a little meal. You know what I mean? You wasn't. This is not when you was. Pregnant. You wasn't even showing yet. I, no, I was pregnant. I just wasn't. You wasn't like, showing yet. Yeah, I wasn't showing at all. But um, <clears throat> basically, so the moving man finally get here right there helping us, and like the guy, like he like peeks out the window, and like he's like, wow, he he like, oh, he like he telling his his friend and all the people that's moving in, like, like look at this, like look at this, they're all gathering around the window, and they're looking at a girl. They're like, oh, that she's fire, like. You don't know the things, like, you know what I mean? Like, I would love to have that. Like, they're saying all these things, you know what I mean? And I don't know who they're talking about. He's calling me over there as well. Like, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? So I go and check, and it's Queen. A lot of men in that predicament would probably get mad. Yeah. Or upset, you know what I mean? And what do I say? I say, like, oh, you, you think she's fire? Like, she's fire, right? And they're like, yeah, yeah, she's fire. And I'm like, yeah, that's my girl. <laughs> and then he was scared, like he was scared a little bit. Like he's like, he like my fault, my fault. I didn't mean. I'm like, bro, nah, you good? Like, nigga, if, like it, it's a compliment to me if niggas want my girl. Like to me, like if we're walking and people are staring at you, and uh, to me that's like a compliment. Yeah. Cause right now I'm here Some and people not you. Get jealous. Yeah. No, no, I know a lot of people get jealous, but that's just a certain person I am. Like she and I could tell she's not used to having a person like me. Like. Even when you're getting dressed for your your shows and shit, I pull her shorts up. I do, cause it looks better, it looks sexier. Um, I, we don't need your shorts at your knees, like you know what I mean? Yeah. Even though you're pregnant, you could still look sexy and be sexy. Yeah. You know I say, she'll look at me like, oh, you different, or like you, like you sure, like. Yeah. So that's <laughs> you know real. That's real important to have in a relationship is com confidence. Yeah, confidence is very. Confidence. Important. I still have little insecurities, but. I think you know, like I have reasons why I have my insecurities, but he don't ever make me feel bad about them. So, um, 
I guess, yeah, that's really important because if you don't have, if you lack confidence and you'll get jealous yeah, about a lot of jealous. stuff. That's what I'm saying. You'll yeah, get jealous. Saying, even though you may say you're not that confident and you're not that, you have to have a certain level of confidence, honestly, to be with a person like me. Yeah. It has to because the, the same happened in my past relationship. That The same thing I'm doing now, I used to do back then too yeah, when I used cool. to host clubs and do like I never did meet and greets like how I'm doing now but I host clubs and it I, I used to girls. take a lot of pictures and I used to have a lot of girls around me so it's like but that caused problems do you get what I'm saying so for you to deal with what I'm doing it's like it's it still takes a level a certain I think level I was of kind of I think I was kind of prepped for this though already yeah I was prepped for this I was also with someone before who was surrounded, like, like, who was, like, who in the spotlight, the who spotlight. had the same thing. It's just they did, you know, did differently. But, I mean, the trust, the trust is there. I don't, I don't see any mistrust with that. But I think the only thing that we never really, we never. Nah, we don't argue. I think the only thing we, we do disagree on is, like, what you said, like, how we were raised. It's just disagreements or, like, a lack of understanding. Yeah. You know? One of my tips, I would say, um... Don't go to sleep mad. No. I feel like at least you should say something to the person before you go to sleep. I don't think you should wake up the same way. At least say something. Even if the person do feel some kind of way when they wake up, at least y'all spoke the night before. And then, you know, show that you care. I still got to show that I care, but I still got to give him his, give him his space too. But I think yeah, if but I... Even if you give me your, like, all right. Even like say let us disagree and you give me my space. I like I still like do nothing to like I don't bring you down or like no or, you're like still oh or like oh since I'm mad at you you carry your bags no like, you know I what I mean it. or like since I'm mad at you or since we're disagreeing like you worry about your food yeah or no no you, he like nah that's, that, that's, that's when it like that's when it starts getting petty. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? That's when it starts getting petty. And then you start to lose, like, respect for people. You know what yeah, I mean? Or like, you think or you think they don't love you. Or you don't think they care. Like, Nah, he's still like, you hungry. I do it too, though. Nah, you do. That, and I that's, still that's make, it. like, if we home, like, I still make food and, at, like, bring him a plate. Or ask him, do we want to eat? Like, I'm not going to. We still look out. We're basically, the tip is, like, still look out for your significant other. Even if you're not on good terms. Or the best of terms, or even if it's just a little disagreement, just still continue to be that person for that person. You know what I mean? Continue to be what that person needs. Like, and I would say if somebody, if, if they show you, I mean, if they tell you that something's wrong, really try to work on it, like, and examine yourself, or you could, you could. Or lose. just give it at least give it some thought, because what if it's not true? Or like, what if you look back and be like, But it's Yo, still I, good to examine I, I, no, yourself No, no, yeah, for sure, that's what I'm saying. What if you look at it and like, damn, what, what she's saying is like, I think it's wrong. Like, I don't do that. You know what I mean? You could it's, then for take it to that person and then talk about it again. Like, it don't always got to be, all right, just because like, you feel like that, you're right. I think the number one key is just understanding. Understanding, communication, Com confidence. And communication. And I, another one would be like honesty. Yeah, like I like I like how I like our our relationship when it comes to that honesty. You know I'm always keep it a buck with you. Nah, he do. <laughs> you know I'm always keep it a buck with you. A lot of people like, especially like the type of person she is and how big she is and how like like you're a star. Like you know what I mean. Everybody around her is going to say yes, yes, yes. And even me, there's so many yes people around me where it's like... Yeah, but he'll tell me no. Like, yo, do this outfit look fire? Like, yeah, yeah, that's fire, that's fire. You got what I'm saying? But you always need to have that person and be like, like, nah, man, you look crazy. Like, you know what I mean? Or like, nah, bro, you tripping. Like, yeah. you know what I mean? So, I think honesty is big. Like, honesty is big. I just feel like, once again, me and him have different, like ways about honesty because he just straight up blunt so he'll just say it me i'll be i'll kind of like try to like i'll like walk around it a little but i i'll be like well like for example if if i don't like something right i won't be like straight up like no i don't like that like to, i'll be like well i mean is there I, something else i like or it is there but another color or? yeah like 
I'm sure like, they don't got this. Like I and that, another thing, I think that leads to knowing your partner. Also, I know you. Like so, I know you. Like even, like even at the slightest look you give me, I know what that means. Like, like well, but I mean, I'm not saying I don't like it, but instead of just saying no, I don't like it. I kind of just have a hard time being like straight yeah. forward. That's that's what I would say. I would say, nah, I'm on. I, don't I just because or, you know why I actually. try to walk around people's feelings so much and he don't so the so the main factors that are important What do we say again? Um, honesty, honesty communication communication confidence confidence understanding understanding Those are the main things and I feel like The answer uh, to do we argue? Dang, I don't want to say no like we per we disagree barely we barely do. Barely. But we disagree and um, we always make up though. But it's like, it's been, I've known makeup, you for probably like a year or some change now. <laughs> and not once have we had an argument. It ain't been like never to the point where like, we going back and forth like yelling at yeah. each other. Like, not once argue. So like, storming just out. that alone, I, I'm, appreci I'm appreciative for that. You know what I'm saying? Because... You have the capability to make my life a living hell. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I have the capability and the power to, and yeah. so do you, but we don't use that. You know what I mean? So that's what I appreciate you for, because I love you. You know what I'm saying? You could make my my life a living hell. So it's like, I appreciate but, that you don't. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because a lot of people would take advantage of that power. That's the power that I was talking to you about when we first, first started talking. That I don't like when people have that power over me. You know what I mean? Yeah, I remember you said you didn't want to fall in love yeah. no more. Or ever again. You didn't want to love someone because you didn't want to give somebody that power. But yeah. I, people usually abuse that power. I That's more why. so want to make you happy. So, yeah. We cool. I love him. He's my friend. Yeah, we still friends, friends y'all. Friends first. We start off as close friends. Some, and now you're my you girlfriend. Boyfriend, I love right. him. Um, yeah, we're not you. perfect. I love you too, little fella. We're not perfect, but um, this is my son here, so I know this. <laughs> Cut it. All right, wait, babe, you gotta do it because okay. I can't reach. Love y'all, appreciate y'all, gang, gang.